Morning Motai, one of the very first teachings in Pirkei Avot that the Anshek Nistagdona taught us is Ve'amidu Talmidim Harbe, to establish many students. It's a very interesting Mishnah, in, uh, it's actually a Masechet Ketana, Baraita, in Avot de Rabbi Natan, he brings a Machloket between Bet Shammai and Bet Hillen. Bet Shammai writes that a person can only teach a Talmid, can teach Torah to a Talmid who is wise, humble, a Ben Torah with Midot, only that kind of person can you teach. Bet Hillen disagrees and says to teach Torah to everybody because there were many sinners and criminals among Am Yisrael that came back to Judaism as a result of the light of the Torah. At first glance, the opinion of Bet Shammai seems to be much more understandable. If a person is unscrupulous, as a result of learning even a small amount of Torah, he can feel like he knows everything and start arguing on Gedulei Israel. And uh, history has even shown many times that people learned a little bit of Torah and caused a lot of damage. So Bet Shammai seems a little bit more logical over here. So Bet Hillel nevertheless disagrees. And Maran Zechon Merchab brings down in Anaf Etzavot that even though the Alachah follows Bet Hillel, that a person should teach any person, nevertheless, it doesn't mean anybody. It means when we're not sure if the person is unsavory. We don't know. We don't know what's inside. But if a person really sees that the Talmid, that the student is, you know, has bad intentions and whatever it is, or he's not Shomer Torah Mitzvot and he's, you know, not, uh, not a good person inside, you're not allowed to teach him Torah. It's a Gemara. It's a Gemara in Masechet Chulin that says, it's a Gemara in Chulin Dav Kufla Gimal that says that if a person teaches a student who's unworthy, nofel begehinam, Hashanah can fall into Gainam, so it's a very dangerous thing. Nevertheless, Maran Tzachon Varcha writes that in a generation like today, according to Bet Hillel, a person should teach even sinners. And he says even people who Shalom, are incarcerated, they're in jail, whatever it is, the light of the Torah can bring them back, especially when factoring that nowadays most of the people who are not Shomer Torah Mitzvot and Am Yisrael, they can be considered Tinokot Shanishbu. It's a result of their... Uh, broken secular education system, that's why they turn out like that. So it's a mitzvah to teach them and bring the light of Torah into their lives. And the only time a person should not be teaching the Talmud is when you know that his kavana is, he has you know, bad intention to use the Torah to destroy and to use the Torah as a weapon, then be'emet, that's the, the only time that a person should not teach a Talmud when his intention is known to be bad. But otherwise, it's a mitzvah to bring him closer and to be Mekareva Geula by teaching Amisa and Torah. Have a wonderful day.